Hey and welcome to another World of Warcraft patch 8.3 video. This time we are gonna look at the mecha gnomes. I have already made a video on Vulpera so feel free to check that out. And yeah here we go mecha guns which I am really excited about even though I don't play alliance but this is a really good looking class. We have warrior, hunter, rogue, priest, mage, warlock and monk these are playable. Compared to the Volpira, the Volpiras can be shamans, but um, gnomes can't be shamans here. And we have the male and female uh, gender here as well, starting with the skin color. So uh, I think the skin colors are basically the same ones, there is nothing spectacular. I mean a little bit whitish, a little bit brownish, these are the things. and. The face, uh, for face I think I should change the modification so you can see the whole expression of the faces. Let me see, there we go. Now you can see the whole face. Now, okay, uh, it can be an old gnome if you want. I guess you have the options. Other than that, pretty good I guess. In general I think the female gnomes looks really cute. And the hairstyles. Yeah, I pretty much like the hairstyles. These are the basic gnomish style. This one looks nice. Okay. <laughs> this one is also good looking. I like this one. It has some sort of human style, I guess. The hair colors. White, blonde, brown, brown, then gray. Let's make it white. And the modification, which is I think the most interesting part. Look at these things. This looks really good. This looks really awesome. And there is so much options though. I really like this one. This has, <laughs> this is kind of like the Robocop style. And you have the arm upgrades, uh, some of the visual changes of your mechanical arm. And the leg upgrades, you're probably not gonna see it, it's down there. But there is still only two. I think they will add more. But yeah, other than that, these are the female ones. Let's check out the male ones. Again, I'm going to remove the face modifications so that you can see the whole face, the skin colors, the basic stuff. N nothing, uh, no changes from the female ones. The face, okay. Where is the old one? Is this the old one? Is this the old looking one? Probably. The hairstyles. <laughs> these are the common I think the gnome style here if you have played the mecha uh, mecha gun or uh, that that island one I can't remember the name right now if you saw those uh, gnomes they have this kind of hairstyles even I think the normal gnomes have the hairstyles the colors and the facial hairs you have the mustache here looks nice and the modification let's see how it looks like with the modification this is awesome look at this really good really really good I like this one <laughs> the eyes they also moves and everything arm upgrades uh, so far three or four the leg upgrades only two I think they can work on that part as well make it a little bit more colorful maybe so let's start and get in we made a warrior so we start in the Mechagon city I think Let's check that out. Yes, we start at Mechagon City. And let's see. We, let, first of all, see the mount. Mount, mount, mount. What's the name of the mount? Mechagon. There we go. That's the one. Oh, it's in my shortcut actually. It's in my shortcut. Let me check that out. Let's ride that mount looks really nice I hope there we go that's the gnome type of mound you can expect I will teleport to Stormwind so I'm not going to stay here there's no quest line no quest line you're just gonna go to Stormwind and start your stuff so this is how the mount looks like this is how you're gonna ride and yeah make a gun city I'm just taking it out for some reason Looks nice. So the main thing again, I want to see how this thing dances. 
Oops. Okay, D S E. <laughs> As I expected, he, he does the robot dance. He's actually doing the robot dance here. This looks awesome. Let's check the ratios. Uh, these are the tank specs, I guess. Yeah, these are the tank stuff. Let's see. Hmm. Combat analysis. Your gather. Uh, what is it? Okay, we also have rearm. When you fall below 20% health, heal for 20% of your maximum health. This. Okay, not bad. Combat analysis. This is the one you're gonna stack up your primary stat. For every five seconds and it will go up to eight so combining with rearm which gives you some healing I th and the stats will go up I think this will be kind of good for tanking I guess or even like a melee mm, melee combat I guess in the arenas what other ratios they have Combat analysis, rearm, mastercraft, your function as a personal blacksmith anvil, cooking fire and mining forge in addition, your limbs include every profession tool. Wow. That's that's really handy for anyone who likes to do professions, especially those uh, blacksmith or cooking. So that's kinda handy I guess. I mean the Volpiras they give you some extra stuff if you grind the humanoids and the mechanons will actually help you out for crafting stuff when it comes to profession. So I guess these are the only uh, ratios we have. We have the strider here this looks really nice. So pretty much this is the overview for the gnomes. What do you think about it? Are you gonna play it? I don't play alliance so probably not gonna make one but maybe if I'm bored probably I will make one. And what do you think about the ratios? I think uh, they, they have pretty much a couple of strong ratios compared to the Vulpiras. So let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.